Well, tonight, a big show of support in Beaver County. Teachers crashed a Hopewell Area School Board meeting. Jennifer Barrasso shows us what they want. The teachers union president says the contract expired last July. They can't agree on salaries and health care. Tonight, they put pressure on the board, held a rally before the meeting, and then went inside. A packed Hopewell Area School Board meeting. Teachers have gone without a contract since July 1st, 2022. Signs reading, we teach, we care, be fair. About 200 people showed up, including parents. I want to make sure that they know that they are valued and thank them for what they are doing for our students. Um, I don't know the details of negotiations, but I can tell you whatever they're asking for is deserved. They are constantly doing more than what is contractually obligated. All I'm asking for is that our teachers get a fair contract that we need to do whatever it is to keep our kids in school. Hopeful Education Association Union President Jeffrey Holmesiak says so far there have been 15 negotiating sessions since November 2020, but no deal has been struck. Holmesiak tells me they want a five year deal and a meaningful pay increase, more than the nearly 2% increase the district is offering. They don't want to pay more for their health care and they don't want to work longer hours and not be compensated. Uh, salary and health care are the biggest sticking points for any district. Um, and obviously, you know, they want a, an extended school year uh, and more time throughout the week for us to work without, you know, giving us salary that's commensurate with, with what they're asking. School Board President Danny Santia. Be fair to the taxpayers and the teachers. I mean, I want to give them a fair contract, but it has to be fair to the whole community. 1,800 to 2,000 students attend Hopewell area schools. Are these teachers prepared to strike? Uh, if it comes down to that, uh, if it's what comes on the table, uh, we don't want to do that to our students. We want to be in the classroom. The union president says there are three negotiating meetings scheduled. This Thursday is one of them. Jennifer Barrasso, KDKA TV News.